This is Dental All-Stars, where we bring you the best in dentistry on marketing, management, and training. Hi, friends. Welcome to your weekly motivational moments with Eric Vickery, president of coaching at All-Star Dental Academy. Today, I want to talk to you about why is it that we continue to educate ourselves, continue education, and how do we ensure we're improving in the education that we're taking? How do we make sure it sticks? And so I want you to write down these things. So for a moment, think about what's the point of continuing our education? What are some answers you would get? You can even pause this if you want. When it all boils down to the things we hear are, you know, uh, we, we want to learn more, we want more knowledge, and we want to improve ourselves, right? And so, but if you continue to play that forward, all of those things add up to results. We want to get improved results. So what does that mean? Well, what that means is you need to know what, how to get results. You need to know what the results formula is. So here's what I want you to write down. Write down the word results. You can draw an arrow over to the right. I want you to write down the word actions. And then I want you to draw an arrow to the right, and I want you to write the word beliefs. And you could do double arrows back and forth if you'd like. The whole point is this, is the results you're getting in your life are based upon the actions you take. The actions you take are based upon the beliefs that you have in your life. What you believe, therefore you behave, therefore you get results. So if you don't like the results you're getting, you got to change the actions. Uh, you might also need to change the beliefs. So a lot of the things that we teach are focusing on how to change your action, which means we might be challenging your belief about something. Oh, my patients will never go for that. Uh, you know, my team members, they don't, they don't do the things I want them to do because they don't operate that way. And that's the yeah, but voice up in your head. So think about this. Where do your beliefs come from? Next to beliefs, above beliefs, somewhere you can write information. The information you are gleaning, the information you're giving is creating a belief that you have, which therefore creates the actions. So underneath the actions, here's what you can write. Well, what sort of actions do I want to be taking? Well, there's a 100% guaranteed way to achieve a goal. If you say, hey, my belief is I want to achieve this goal, well, what do you need to put in place in action to get there? Two things. You can write this, intentionality plus mechanism. What does that mean? Intentionality is determination factor, and mechanism is just your system. So if you have the determination factor to get it done, no matter what, it's just about, about figuring out what is the mechanism. So we're here to help you with your systems, with your verbal skills, with anything it takes on mechanism. We're also here to inspire you, but at the end of the day, your discipline is going to be better than any sort of motivation. So this week, I really want you thinking about what's your intentionality like, what's your determination factor, and what are the mechanisms that aren't giving you the results you want in your life? What sort of beliefs do you have about those things, those actions that you're taking, those systems that you're using, and what do you need to do to change those? Have a great week, guys. We hope you enjoyed this episode of Dental All-Stars. Visit us online at allstardentalacademy.com.